Hello everyone, this is David from Automotive Press. As you know, I have a real passion for thinking about the future and what's coming down the pipeline. So I have been talking about the 2022 Toyota Tundra and most recently about the 2023 4Runner along with other models too, such as the Sequoia and Lexus LX. Uh, but now I'm beginning to think about 2024 Toyota Tacoma, which should come out in about two years or so. So we expect uh, the timing to be about the summer or fall of 2023 calendar year to be introduced as a 2024 model year. Now that new generation Tacoma is still quite a long time away. So very little information has been uh, leaked from Toyota or anyone else for that matter. But I'm digging deep and wide to try to get as much information as possible and try to figure out what that Tacoma might look like in about two years time. It's a very exciting time for Toyota because not only are we getting the brand new Tundra this year, uh, we are also getting a new 4Runner next year and then the new Tacoma the following year, not to mention also a new Sequoia at the end of next year uh, along with a whole bunch of other Lexus models. So it's a really, really exciting time for Toyota and Lexus next couple of years. But I figured it's time to talk about the Tacoma, mainly because I own the 2021 Tacoma TRD Pro uh, in fact, I own the 2018 Tacoma TRD Sport. I also own the 2019 Tacoma TRD Pro. And then most recently, I have the Lunar Rock 2021 Tacoma TRD Pro. Now, I'm most likely trading in the Tacoma TRD Pro for the Tundra TRD Pro when the new one comes out this fall and possibly changing that to the 4Runner in next summer when the new 4Runner comes out. So I've got pretty busy uh, schedule myself but my heart is always with the Tacoma because it's a perfect size for me. It's not too big. The bed side is just the right size and it's very comfortable and it's fun to drive. And it's just one of those cool trucks that I always enjoy owning. So I finally created my first draft of a 2024 Tacoma rendering or image. Now, of course, this is very speculative at this point and it's very much based on my imagination. So here it is. This is what the 2024 Tacoma TRD Pro might look like. Um, of course, this could change for the next uh, few years as we get more and more spy photo or leaked photo coming through the pipeline. But for now, this is my best shot at what the Tacoma TRD Pro might look like. So what I've done in terms of my rendering is that I incorporate a whole bunch of different ideas based on what we know about the 2022 Tundra, what we know about the 2023 Forerunner, and then a bunch of other insights I gather from Japan. I think the grill will look a little bit like a miniature version of the Tundra that's coming up this fall, and so is the headlight. Uh, I, I believe that there will be more and more common design between the Tundra and Tacoma. So that's what I've done in the front of this rendering. Again, it's a little hard to say which direction Toyota will go. It's still a few years away. Uh, but this is my best guess. And in terms of side profile, if you look carefully, I've incorporated a little bit more of a larger and a more prominent crease going over the wheel wells and down the side and then going to the rear of the truck. I think that will give you a little bit more of a distinctive look along the lines of Land Cruiser, which have, uh, again, more prominent side profile. I've enlarged the tailgate also a little bit. Uh, with mostly red tail lamp, which could be darkened for TRD Pro. And I raised the bed height because right now the Tacoma has a pretty low uh, bed uh, height and sometimes I have a hard time putting in a larger cooler in the back. And that's one of my biggest complaints about the Tacoma. And so I've raised the, the Tacoma's uh, bed height for this rendering. And basically I made the whole truck a little bit larger, not too much larger but just a little bit longer and tiny bit wider, which is what I suspect will happen to Tacoma. It's gonna grow in size for sure. To compete with the likes of the GMC slash Chevrolet trucks, which are a little bit bigger to begin with, and also the upcoming new Ranger, which will be larger as well. So those are all the things that uh, could happen. Uh, in terms of power train, of course, it's a little hard to tell now, but because the Tacoma will share the same TNGA-F platform, with the Tundra, with the Sequoia, and then with the 4Runner, it's going to share many of the components as well. So I suspect the engine will become the 2.4 liter twin turbo four cylinder engine that is now going into the 2022 Lexus NX. But that engine should cascade down to the new 4Runner 
and also to the new Tacoma. That would be my prediction. And right now, that 2.4 twin turbo has 275 horsepower and 317 foot-pounds of torque in the new Lexus NX. So I suspect a little bit more power and also a bump in the torque for application in a truck. So maybe 285 horsepower and upwards of 325 to 350 foot-pounds of torque for the Tacoma pickup truck. So that's sort of the range I'm thinking of. It should be mated to the 8-speed automatic transmission. That's the transmission that's being uh, used in the Lexus NX with a 2.4 turbo. Uh, and of course, we don't know whether Toyota will keep any of the V6 engine for the Tacoma. But uh, all the direction for Toyota in the future is moving toward smaller displacement turbo engines with a higher fuel economy and higher fuel efficiency. So I really doubt that the current 3.5 liter or the 4 liter V6 from the 4Runner will migrate to the new Tacoma. I don't think that's going to happen. But who knows? Things can change. I will say that Toyota will offer a hybrid or plug-in hybrid or potentially even a full EV for the Tacoma during the first couple of years of the new generation being introduced. So I predict a few possible options. Uh, that new 2.4 liter twin turbo four cylinder engine in the 2022 Lexus NX could be mated to hybrid uh, system. That's one option. Uh, second is that perhaps the current hybrid system that's already in the RAV4 or in the Highlander could migrate to the Tacoma. Uh, I doubt that because that's not enough power and torque for the truck. Uh, third option is a plug-in hybrid. Again, migrated from the current RAV4 Prime. That one definitely has enough power and torque. Uh, and then, of course, the final possible situation is a full EV with a fully battery electric vehicle system, much like the one we are seeing in the Toyota Concept electric car. So that uh, fully electric EV system could be the powertrain for Tacoma as well. So I think there are a couple of options, but most likely we're going to end up with a 2.4 twin turbo four cylinder engine and a hybrid or plug-in hybrid system for the new Tacoma. The interior of the new Tacoma should be vastly different because the current Tacoma is very outdated. It has most of the technology that we want and it has all the safety technology we want, but it is very outdated in terms of the interface and the infotainment system. So Toyota would adopt the newest uh, Toyota connected system and the Toyota software for the Tacoma, uh, which is actually developed in-house within the North American uh, headquarters uh, because Toyota owns a company called Toyota Connected which design, builds, and develop software and hardware for Toyota products. I am quite familiar with what Toyota Connected does because I am one of the few certified practitioner in what we call Agile Thinking or Scrum Master Certification from Toyota Connected. So I do appreciate how they design the new product and new software. And so it should be a really good system in the new Tacoma. So my image or rendering is still very much work in progress. Uh, so I would love to get some feedback from everyone in terms of what you think of the current uh, rendering that I created so I can tweak it, refine it, evolve it, and improve it for future videos. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you think of the 2024 Tacoma TRD Pro or 2024 Tacoma in general uh, because we are all very excited about this new product and there's still a couple of years away, but we can keep on dreaming about the future of Toyota trucks. Thank you so much for watching. A lot more information to come soon.